The Chunbukyong is the very first scripture in the history of mankind that humanity received from God, the supreme governor of the universe, Sangjenim. The word Chunbu means that it is the law of the heavens or God's mandate. According to records, the Chunbukyong was originally passed down orally by the eastern nation of Huanguk, the first nation ever established by humanity in the Tian Shan Mountains in Central Asia 9,000 years ago. Then it was passed on to the Bedal dynasty that succeeded Huanguk. During the time of Tangun Chosan, they recorded the scripture using the alphabet they developed at the time. Later in history, the great scholar of the unified Shila dynasty, Chue Chiwan, found a monument that had the Chunbukyong engraved on it. He translated it using the hanja that we use today and revealed it to the world. He also chose a rock in the mountains and engraved the Chunbukyong on the rock and left it as a monument. This is how it was possible for the Chunbukyong to be passed down till now. The Chunbukyong is a very short scripture made of 81 letters, but it contains the principles of the universe and the meaning of human life. In other words, it contains the ultimate level of truth. Chunbukyong uses numbers 1 through 10 to explain about the secrets of the universe. It is the original scripture of sacred numerology, of cosmic mathematics. Of all the numbers in the Chunbukyong, the most common is number 1, which symbolizes the ultimate existence as the origin of the universe and the foundation of all living things. The number 1 also represents Tao, God, or the Creator. This number 1 self-manifests to the three ultimate beings, or the three ultimates of heaven, earth, and humanity. Heaven, earth, and humanity are collectively a self-manifestation of God in that all three of them contain equal divinity as the Creator. They are the living God in the phenomenal realm. The profound teachings on human beings, God, cosmology, and the history of the Eastern culture come from this ideology of the three ultimates. Heaven and earth are in place of God as they take on the roles of the father and the mother of humanity. Humanity came into being through the power of the creation transformation of heaven and earth. It will become the most dignified form of being that achieves the will and the ideology of God. This is the reason human beings are not just a mere creation. Human beings can use the hand of God in the realm of God and bring harmony to heaven, earth, and humanity to achieve the ultimate purpose of the will of God and the principle of the universe. Meditation is the process of faith and devotion for us to reach that level. The Chunbukyong defined the ultimate being of the universe and the relationship between the living creators in the reality of heaven, earth, and humanity as the heavenly one, earthly one, and the Te'il, the Supreme One. When they call humanity Te'il, the Supreme One, it means that humanity is a more noble being than heaven and earth. All the rules about human beings in Eastern culture have their roots in the culture of the Chunbukyong. The next verse in the Chunbukyong clearly shows us why the Te'il Ju mantra is the most important and the holiest mantra and why its self-healing life energy is the most powerful in the history of the evolution of human civilization over the last 10,000 years. Desam Hamyu, when humanity becomes one mind and one body with heaven and earth, the cosmic parents, the number six that represents the water of eternal life comes down to us. This is why the number six is in the center of the Chambugyang. The Teilju Mantra gives us the eternal water energy that is represented by the number six so that we may become the beings of Teil. 
The blessing of enlightenment attained through meditation is that humanity becomes reawakened. This is the will of the universe and the purpose of human life. The Chunbu Gyeong is indeed a scripture of infinite awakening that defines all the profound laws of the universe of heaven, earth, and humanity, which uses the ultimate number one as the substance and functions in three.